Methane is a colourless and odourless gas found throughout the world and is currently the second most harmful greenhouse gas threatening the Earth's atmosphere. Levels of methane have been measured at approximately 1800 parts per billion, which seems rel relatively insignificant, but this gas is 20 times as effective at absorbing heat than carbon dioxide. Methane is extremely flammable and is an ongoing explosive hazard when working in underground mining operations. Methane has impacted on my life due to my environmental activism. I am a strong supporter of renewable energy and keeping our world healthy. I have been participating in environmental activities such as Clean Up Australia Day and Planet Ark's Tree Day. Therefore, the compound methane and its effect on the ozone layer are close to my heart. This compound is produced naturally by volcanic activity and livestock and is found in mining operations around petroleum. Because of the boom in livestock export trade and the mining industry over the last century, more of this gas is being released into the atmosphere than ever before. The structure of this is four hydrogen atoms arranged around a central carbon atom, making this a hydrocarbon and giving it a tetrahedral shape. It contains four single nonpolar covalent CH bonds. What this means is that an electron is being shared between each hydrogen atom and the central carbon atom. The hydrogen atoms have one valence electron, while carbon has four valence electrons in its outer shell. Carbon makes four covalent bonds through hydrogen sharing their electron. As seen using compound building software, the four hydrogens attach to the central carbon atom and make four bonds to complete carbon's outer shell. This allows each hydrogen cation to have a charge of plus one and the carbon anion a charge of negative four. The 3D view of this compound shows each hydrogen molecule an equal distance apart from each other. Methane takes approximately 12 years to break down in the atmosphere by natural processes. However, methane reacts with O2 in the atmosphere to produce CO2 and H2O. This poses a further problem as it is breaking down into another greenhouse gas. It is also broken down by combustion, which happens at 4.4 to 17% air concentration, and also creates carbon dioxide and water. Methane has a melting point of negative 182 degrees, so it is very rarely seen as a solid. Methane has had a large impact on my life and will continue to in the future. Its tetrahedral shape is its defining characteristic and allows the four covalent bonds to be made between the carbon and hydrogen atoms. I'm John Kelly and thanks for watching.